Welcome back. It's episode four of our Let's Play of Shadow Complex Remastered on the Xbox One. They said last time, they said episode three. They said it was, uh, it took too long. I had to retry too many times. You know, this time, episode four, I'm gonna give you guys a real, uh, real treat. I'm gonna destroy this shit. What I'm gonna do. No mistakes. Oh, I lied. It was a, it was a big fat lie is what I did. You know, I'm gonna hide up here. I'm pretty sure they'll just go away. I trust in it. Alright. So me being, me getting caught up at the end of uh, last episode, that was my fault. That was me. But I'm still holding true to uh, what I, what I promised, which is lightning fast gameplay. A true exercise of skill. It's probably not gonna be that, but I'm gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna put in some work in episode four, and we're gonna start by getting our fucking hyperdrive upgrade thing. Except we don't get it all at once. Classic kind of Metroid thing, where you just get small upgrades, um, pieces of a final suit. Who is he? His face doesn't match anyone. Attention all members, Armored Defense Squad. Spread out and find him before he does more damage. So now we have the CLD thrust back, which gives us a little, a little huh huh, allows us to double jump. Let's look at more information. It's It enables the boost jump. Now let's see, yeah, we haven't really looked at the uh, inventory all that much. There's some training and stuff. Uh, here shows some stats. I've killed 190 people. So that's, you know, reassuring. It's gonna be hard to sleep tonight. Here's a little, uh, little, uh, preview. We're gonna get foam, missiles, and something called a friction dampener. That'll be tons of fun. I hope. I feel like I'm approaching this from the wrong side. Nope. I was just, I was just sucking. Alright, cool. Claire, you there? Right here, Jason. You okay? I'm fine. I scored some kind of, I don't know, jetpack or something from some armor I saw. Can it fly us out of here? I don't think so. Short burst only. But I'm Oops. getting around faster. Find that armor you mentioned. That'll get us both out of here. Exactly what I was thinking. Ah, fuck. I was trying to stick it. I was trying to sequence break, but I couldn't do it because I suck. I do like how he has like this dope ass suit now. And just one part is upgraded. Oh, deal with it. Write a letter home, buddy. Cry me a river, man. You died. And I got a I got a grenade upgrade. Now I can hold more grenades. Good room for us. Solid solid encounter. Well. We did a we did a 180. Level 14. If this game's really good at like, uh, yeah, just rewarding you over and over for little things that you really didn't do do anything for. There's a question mark, so I'm just gonna sidetrack real quick and uh, see. Oh, wait, is that? Uh, nope, that's missiles. We'll have to come back eventually. I feel like there's something I can reach here now because I have my my choo choo. I was correct. I can get a grenade upgrade. I feel good about being correct sometimes. I'm not trying to be pompous, but it's a thing I know. All right. But did I just dick myself out of getting up there? Do we have to do the whole? Oh, you know what? I'm o I'm okay. I'm okay with doing that again. Let me see if there's any cool little passages. Nope. I'm gonna drown if I try that. We can take the little ride again. I'm down with it. I'm, I'm completely cool with taking the little ride again. And this way, if for some reason this is your first uh, video in the series, you get to you get to experience this too. If you want the other ride, go back to episode 2, I think. Dun, 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 dun. Maybe episode 3, I can't remember. Whoa! <laughs> Glitch City! 
glitch fucking city. We just go ahead and we can add that one to the uh, pool of... ever-growing pool of glitches we've encountered so far. For our, our inevitable glitch series, or glitch compilation, or glitch something that I'll probably end up putting together. Let's try and make it this time. Alright, cool. I'm glad that it didn't glitch this time. But I'm, I'm kind of glad it glitched the first time. It shows you start to see the seams, you know? Breaking the immersion. Everything around you is a lie. It's all fabric. It's all paper mache, Matthew McConaughey would say if it was uh, True Detective Season season 2. Season 1, I should say. The good season, not the bad season. Harsh words coming from me in regards to True Detective. But I like that first season a lot. The second season kind of let me down. You're probably, you're probably sitting there like, why why is he talking about an HBO series I don't, I don't, I haven't watched? Rather than this game. And it's because I'm just trying to fly through it, guys. Let me just, let me... Bitch, don't kill my vibe. <laughs> I'm looking for this collectible like I'm gonna get it. I know where it is. Oh, God. I know where it is, I just don't... Yeah, I don't have time right now. Critical path, man. Critical path. It's kind of spooky. A little, a little spooky. Nope, back to murder. Okay. <laughs> Quickly re-engaging in the murderous lifestyle we have now come... Oh, there's... Nope, there's an upgrade right there. I can probably get it. Let me just... Let me just... Let me just... Let me just give me a hold on, just let me uh let me just yeah, just let me uh nope. Just let me uh just let me uh, let me, uh yeah. Um I might have been wrong. I might have been yeah, no I is that, okay. I was misreading the map, that was my bad. Let's continue. Who knows what awaits us? More murder. Becoming, becoming a very prominent thing in this game. Hmm. I don't feel so bad for the guys who get the hand-to-hand -hand combat. He's, at least he's not sadistic in the way he kills people with his hands. He's not kind of, he's not a hands-on kind of killer. Boo! I really like that whole mechanic. Let me go in the. All right. What's our current objective to keep people up to date? Is to find out where the Omega armor was moved. Cause this is we're gonna we're gonna um we're gonna take our girlfriend out of here with this armor. It's a water puzzle. I feel like this wouldn't be glowing if I if they didn't want me to shoot it, you know what I mean? Yeah, see? I'm just I was shooting the wrong part. This shit takes a lot of bullets. There it goes. So I told you I'd be swift. I mean I didn't think that the game was gonna stop me from being swift. Get a little, get a little update there. We're moving quick. We're moving quick. Ain't no time for silly games. I like how this, this, uh, this, oops, I have to kill everybody. This facility is not only expansive, but it is varied in its, uh, decor. You know, you got some modern family shit, you got some glass, you got some sci-fi kind of bullshit going on. Whoa. This is a shortcut. Oh, it's not a shortcut. I just didn't want to end up in all that shit. I don't know what to think about you guys. They want to be seen as liberators. So this is some kind of, um... Oh, it's just like, uh, alright. 
it's uh, it's like a new world order kind of bullshit. <clears throat> like I said originally, got another collectible by the way. Uh, like I said originally, I, the the game isn't cool because of the story. It's not some like Bioshock Infinite level deepness, you know. Even that story isn't super super complex, but it ain't about the, the narrative in this one. It's about the the pleasure of getting the upgrades and retrace your steps, find secrets, some of that good, good nostalgia, that old, um, Nintendo. There's a missile upgrade over there I just can't get quite yet. Sorry, they want me to kill more people. Am I good? Can I go now? No? Okay, do they want me to go in this vent? That is a possibility. Yeah, I didn't have my light. See, it's kind of hard to see sometimes without the flashlight, because the flashlight's the only thing that lights it up for you, so you can tell what's interactable. Yes, yeah, so these guys are crazy fanatics. They're like, we're gonna liberate baseball teams. I'm pretty sure if you're gonna take over the world, the whole entire MLB is not gonna still be around. New World Order. But yeah, baseball players are still like, yeah, let's play some fucking baseball, man. All right, can you chill? Can you just, ooh, 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 gold bars. Gold bars, gotta get that money, money, honey. Calm, calm down, calm down. I do not remember this part at all. It's stressful. And this shit takes so many bullets. There you go. We can, we can continue our ascent. I'm, I'm making some comments like, hey man, you know you can do this and this and this and you can get up the thing faster. I know there's probably a thing, but I ain't no, you know, awesome games done quick level speedrunner. You know, I'm just a, that's a lie. I actually do speedrun some games. Maybe one time I'll do a video on some of the games I speedrun. But this just isn't one of the games that I do that for. I like the spider tank thing, though. I don't know why we don't just commandeer the spider tank and take our asses out of here. We're on this fucking magical quest for some power-up armor when there's a good old spider tank just waiting to be killed. I got an achievement called Itsy Bitsy Spider. So, not only is this a great let's play, but it doubles as an achievement guide. I believe another video we had also doubled as a trophy guide. So look at us, just two in one videos, teabagging it. Also got some rude comedy, that's a three in one. Kill this guy, kill this guy. Hell yeah. Kill more guys. <laughs> this guy's over here just freaking out. Oh. Alright, good, good. Check my thing real quick. Nope, alright. I am keeping a small eye out for question marks. Just so I don't miss like too many collectibles. They can't hide them from me, but they can be. They can try, and sometimes they're somewhat successful. Got a save room. That's good, just in case I pull up. But I'm not gonna do that on episode four, because I'm taking episode four. We're going quick. Shouts out to this kid's getting a shout out every episode, and only him. This guy Carnage on my uh, Xbox friend list. We got another piece. And what does this piece give us? Cool mask, cool Scoop. mask. We can breathe underwater. Or we have a much larger water life. Let's see, what is it? Um, it's, it works. It's, it's You can breathe underwater and get upgrades like that passkey component part too. But only up to a depth of 100 meters. 
It's good, it's informative. Ah, oh, level 15. I'm glad I went down there. Where are we going now? They want me to do a little bit of bat tracking. You wanna go through there again? Yeah, sure, let's go through there again. I do wanna kill some of these things though, just for fun. But no, I've been ending a lot of human lives, not a whole lot of robotic lives. In this episode particularly. Nothing really compares back to that fucking minigun sequence in like episode 3. Or was that episode I think that was episode 2. Yeah, that shit was crazy. Oh, this is cute. We're getting some underwater travel. It's all been flooded. This guy still just doesn't care. The whole thing's going under and he's just, yep. Aren't you afraid of drowning? You're in uh, such a heavy suit, sir. I feel like this is something I can fuck with. Oh, it's the spider. I just didn't realize from upside down. I didn't I didn't realize. My bad. Oh, we're back on track. Everything's a little moist now. Whoops. Nope, don't care about how your mechanic is supposed to work. There we go, got that. Said I couldn't do it earlier, but now I can. Also couldn't do this earlier, but now I can. Feels good. Good video gaming. Really putting a dent in Shadow Complex. Once again, this is, yeah, Shadow Complex Remastered for Xbox One. It's also on PS4, PC. It's great. Really fantastic piece of gaming. Made by Chair. It's the name of the development studio, an actual chair. They sat in chairs when they were making this game, so I guess it's relevant. It was topical. Maybe it was a little joke, I don't know. Maybe one day we'll have them on, and they'll explain why they're called Chair. If they ever make a Shadow Complex 2, there's a there's a goal, I guess. I really hope they're gonna make Shadow Complex 2. Going deeper and deeper, this became an underwater adventure game. I played one of those already this month. That was called Abzu. Oh, but this one has guns. Perfect. Whoa! We, couldn't, we found an air. We found an airtight seal. This guy is like a monkey up here. Excuse me. Excuse me. That guy got blasted hard off screen. We're back here now. Oh, I don't have the foam thing. I'm not gonna waste my time. Oh, but I am gonna grab this uh, save room, just in case. Just in case. Get your health back up. Never wanna be too cocky. Going back down in the mines. I think we're now going to get the missile upgrade. Let me check our objective. Uh, yep, we're just piecing together the Omega armor right now. I forgot we have to do that thing every time. Or no, we can go under now. Because we have the scuba gear. Get out of my face, kiddo. I thought I saw something sparkling, but I guess no. I guess it's just like five in the morning and I'm tired. It's very calm. It's uh, you know, I said there was gonna be high octane stuff, but you know, we're 20 minutes into this episode and shit, we're swimming. Like playing Little Mermaid. Oh, we're so close. We're about to go in the factory. In episode 5. I'll see you guys on the next episode, alright? It was good. We made some progress. 
we are 31% done with a map. And we're only on episode four. We're going places. We'll be there soon. We've killed 253 people along the way. I hope you guys are around for the next 250. <laughs> I'll see you on the next video, the next episode. Later. <laughs>